Hey there, how's it going on? This video is a little special because I want to share a small incident from my life and in fact many other developers' life. There was one time when somebody came to me and asked me that Hey Tish, I want you to build this website for my business and it's really really urgent. And I charged him $600 and I was able to do that work so much quickly. You know why? Because there is a library like Bootstrap, there is a library like Material CSS and with these library I was able to do my work really efficiently and really fast. The end result came up really beautiful and I was able to earn some money in early days. It felt me so much great that yes, I could have done that manually by myself but these open source projects are so much amazing that helped me to earn money and do my work so much efficiently and so much fast. Not only that, on top of that when I went onto this Bootstrap website, I saw a small button that says click to copy. And when I did a little bit more research, I came to know that there is a creator, Zeno, the developer and founder of this entire library, which you can apply and just have this feature of click to copy. And this made me wonder at how beautiful the world is. Like, just imagine, somebody did so much of work and put this all of the code of Bootstrap, Material CSS and tons of other CSS for us to be used openly and freely. And on top of that, another creator came forward and said, you know what, this is so much beautiful, but I can make it more beautiful. Worked entirely off his weekends and gave us a, another feature on top of that. This is true, the, truly the power of the entire openness and open source. This is the true beauty of how the developers community can come forward and show some creation all together. Now on top of that, if you'll go to these amazing repositories which are totally free to use, some of them are asking you just to buy a beer or a coffee. Uh, there's just a button on the readme file which you can just click and just offer him to buy a beer or a coffee and some of them even don't ask for that. So what I did, years ago, a couple of years ago, I went ahead and bought a book by this creator Zeno. I didn't want to read it honestly, I just wanted to show him my true humble gratitude that yes, I am truly grateful to you and I just want to appreciate that. Not only that, over the years, I have written many messages to the creators, to these open source library repositories, their maintainers. I sometimes, and even most of the times, I don't even get a reply back. But that's not what I expect. I just written those messages so that I can show them some love. My true humble gratitude for their work, the appreciation that they truly deserve. And this whole idea is very noble. In order to appreciate all of this work of openness and the open source, a company DigitalOcean came up with the concept of Hacktoberfest. And by the way, they didn't ask me to make this video, they didn't ask me or sponsor this video or anything like that, they didn't even reach me out. I do use their services just by paying them. If you're watching this, we can definitely talk on this, but that's not about it. Let's forget all of that. What has happened is the past, let's not scratch it again. Today, you need to do something for me and for all the creators and developers. It's my humble request that you do two things. You reach out to the repository which you have been using but didn't pay much attention. You're gonna go to their readme file and if you see a button which says buy me a coffee or buy me a beer, if possible, you're gonna donate something to that person, probably $5, $10, whatever you can. If you cannot, you're gonna reach out to that person on Twitter or Instagram and just write him a thank note saying it's thanks Tober. And just show him some love that we really appreciate your work that you have done for the open source community. We need to show these people some love. So please go ahead, it's my humble request that at least show them some love that they truly deserve. And this whole idea about the Hacktoberfest is to show their appreciation, show them some gratitude but yes, we truly appreciate your work. Go ahead, if you don't want to share this video, no need to share this video. Just go ahead and spread the message that it's Thanks-tober. And we need to thank to these all open source developers, their maintainers, their contributors, and everybody who is even little involved in all of this project. So spread the message, it's time to show them some love. It's Thanks-tober. Should work it out, you know we 
should work it out before I'm too invested. I should probably.